Hello, 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 and welcome, welcome, welcome. How's everybody doing today? Hopefully everybody's doing good. Don't mind me, I still don't even have the game open because I was having, uh... Network issues. I tried to start the stream and... I was dropping literally half the frames due to network lag. Oh, it was dude, absolutely atrocious. Restart the computer, have to troubleshoot the network adapters. Oh, it was a whole thing. Uh, da, 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 da. Uh, and the game is coming up. And I have to confess, I have been playing in my off time as well. And I have not unlocked the two characters that we would be going for, that we were going for on this run. With uh, Gustav and Nesglect. Or not Nesglect, uh, Zek. But I have... Okay. We're now at release. What does it say? Today's the 14th. It, it's... I'm confused. It's two days early. Okay. It wasn't so But it still hold on. Steam, where where what are we doing here? Okay. It still shows as version zero point nine point seven. As can be seen right here, you can't see my mouse. Right here. But if I move myself here, it, it's stated after a year, almost a year after early release, the game is released in its 1.0 version. Um, that doesn't look like version 1.0. And it didn't show any update. Hey, guys, you're drunk. Go home. <laughs> anyway, um, I did unlock both Sylvie and Nesglect. Nesglect was a whole thing. I still ended up dying on the run, but got him unlocked at least. Um, you have to get the Moonstone from Act 1, go to the volcano, get an item from there, and then take it to Act 4. But it's not a key item like most of the other stuff is. It's actually a piece of equipment that just gives you minus three speed. Uh, and it goes in the accessory slot. Um, that is, it's a pretty harsh penalty. Um, you have to take it to the airship in Act 4, and then you unlock Nesglect as well as a, um, equipment item for a 30% discount. But, we're gonna continue our run from... Oh, now you can see my mouse. Go figure. Um, 
we're going to continue our run from last time. And... Yeah, as you see via my... Oh, wait, nope. Ah, flip over. Um, as you see versus uh, via the amount of supplies that I have right here, um, I've, I've been playing a little bit. I've got 97 supplies with a max of 500. I didn't realize they put a max on that. So we're going to, we've already done all of our equipment stuff and everything at the end of last stream. This is from that lost run. Um, so I believe we are in act three, three. So we got to go to Zek here. I mean, and there's nothing even guaranteeing that we're going to unlock Zek on this run because I don't know if it's uh, something that you have to bring with you. Elven Mansion. Um, okay, so yeah, we can because it's there. We'll take this path around this way. Um, we don't have the money to do Beggars at the Gates. So we're going to go this way, come up through this way. Hopefully it doesn't require an item to begin with like it did with Sylvie. Because Sylvie required getting the Moonstone, bringing it here to her to unlock her. Um, so hopefully this is more like Breeze, that there's just, you know, something to do after Zek. Can always hope. Uh, no. I don't want to go to the Eastern Islands. Thank you. A Corrupted Blade for Andrin. I gotta retake a look at decks here. So we got Sharpie Boy going. Going full Sharpie Boy. Charges every turn. Every turn and immune to disarm. Applies bleed. You are essentially f full spiky girl. Um, you actually have no equipment that matters to your build. Because I'm pretty sure you're a full fire build. Yeah. Going full pyro. Oh, I did unlock a new weapon that is a, oh my, holy cripey's weapon. It, it goes for a, a healer, but it's plus three to all damage, plus one charges of bless, and every time that you give a, apply bless, it does damage and apply sanctify to the highest hp mon a monster it's like holy cripe he's going for a f and i was going for a bless build on that run it was a little redonkulous with something like i don't know if he has it in his deck um well with something like sanctuary Applying four bless to everybody. Um, he also had... Oh, uh, which one is it? 
Tome of Knowledge, cards. Uh, nope. Yeah, it's going to be in here. Oh, where be you? Uh, it was the sacred ceremony. That was the other one. So he had sacred ceremonies and sanctuaries. So he was just applying it to everybody across the board. Like basically every turn. So it was almost like he was just playing damage cards even though he was actually healing. Alright, um, so you're a full Sharpie Boy build. We don't need the Corrupted Blade. Pretty sure we don't necessarily need to remove any cards. The couple of decks like Cornelius' is a little thick. That gets rid of itself, that gets rid of itself, that gets rid of itself, that does, those do, that does, and it kind of depends on what you grab. The Hellflame does, okay, so his deck shrinks quite a bit, the Cauterizes... So his deck shrinks, so we don't need to worry about shrinking his deck. Oh, 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 oh. When I don't have headphones in, the game up this far is very loud, and I hate trying to adjust the volume on the actual computer itself. But if I don't turn it back up, you guys won't be able to hear it. Okay, that should be good now. All right, uh, ammunitions. Unupgraded ricochet. We do have a way into stealth for sniper shot. Or for, yeah, for sniper shot. Um. Maybe unupgraded, but I think Ricochet is the way to go here. Uh, will Adrenaline. You're immune to Mark. But not immune to Vulnerable. I don't think you guys do anything to give you Thorns, so that is just for the Vulnerable. Gain some... Stealth and some Sharpie Boyness. And go after the Owl Mages first. Alright, Bree. How'd that feel? Is this the deck that does... No. She does not have one in this deck. Um, it's actually got the upgraded... Um, the upgraded Garden of Thorns now, that double your thorns, oh, so good. Uh, give that to you. I mean, you're already shackled, so giving you a slow is not going to do anything different. Uh, and then we'll smack the owl. Uh, 
All right. Uh, that's so weird that Otis is going first. It's not necessarily a bad thing, because then he can apply the Sanctify and... You alright, buddy? Okay. Uh, let's yeah, keep giving it to Otis here. Smack everybody. Betcha that hurts. Uh, how do we want to do this with seven? Random monster four times everybody. Yeah, that's 16. Well, eight on you. Uh, apply a bunch more. Smack you with that so that we can actually give everybody the chance to heal up here. Okay, you're full on healing. Do, do, do. I mean, just get out of the deck at the moment. It'll activate that. I mean, Andrin and Bree should be able to kill here. Like, they should have lethal. Yeah, she's got lethal on either one at the moment. And even more lethal. So she gets to heal up a little bit. And then we just smack you. And you finish healing up. Very nice. Uh, another stockade with the wrong upgrade. Doesn't mean that we can't flip it over, though. Yeah, we'll grab it. Another camouflage. How many do you have in your deck? Just two? One of the innate. One of the other. So we'd want to go essentially, eventually yellow upgrade on that. Uh, not, and nothing, nothing else. Uh, that means nothing to me. They're immune to slow, adds a freeze to all monsters, which means I need to kill, I, I need to down one or two of them real quick. But I think this party can do it. Hmm. Weak versus fire. Lightning and fire. <laughs> of course, ice. <laughs> and your weakness outside of physical no, outside of physical is fire and holy is your weakest. Lightning, holy lightning, fire, fire, dark. We don't have any dark going on in the party. You got to be the oddball out, of course. To every round, every two rounds. Oh, so I got a little bit of time here. Uh, hit that up. Do that. Grab the ammunitions here. 
grab the shrapnel shot. We can camouflage and do that. And I think you're going to be the biggest problem child outside of the elite. Bet you that hurt. Shouldn't have done that. Five left. I mean... I mean... Do no damage to me? All right, uh, we'll do that. We'll smack you with that. You're immune to the slow, but not the vulnerable. Let's not slow us down. Do you get lethal? Maybe. <laughs> Less so because that's front monster only. Don't think it's going to be enough. Nope. Not quite. <clears throat> Both dead now. Oh, that's a tough choice. The Corrupted Chain Heal or the Mass Dispel? Uh, you're primarily blunt. Blunt piercing, you've got blunt and piercing. But your primarily is de your primarily defense. That is not going to matter because we are eventually going to grab Queen of Thorns. Whenever you'd gain block charges instead of gaining block, gain 30% of those charges as thorns. And due to her perks. Thorns on heroes do not lose charges when hit. So they essentially lose one per turn. Which is more than made up for with her shield of thorns. And her weapon. Way more than made up for. So no, no, no. I mean, it's a really good heal, but also a mass dispel. Do you have a mass dispel in your deck? No. Let's get one in the deck. No! Uh, here you find a rat man who seems to be desperately searching for something. As you approach, you hear him say, Without the key, there's no point in going in. Now that I'm sure everyone is frozen, I thought this was my chance to get back what was taken from me when I was exiled. But where did I leave it? 
I have to find the key no matter what. So, need a key to unlock Zek. Good to know. So, at least we'll get good stuff. Uh, at a storm. They're all resistant to lightning, which doesn't matter to me. That, that that's a good. That's a mythic. Uh, yeah, we're gonna grab the sanctification here. All right. Uh, let's grab that. Do that. Uh, we are going to take. So it's unfortunate that it's not upgraded, because the upgraded actually gives you sharp. Uh, and I have not seen it to actually get it in the deck in the deck, so I still don't even have access to purchasing it. It's such a good card. So... Do I want to gain six or four and do it from stealth? I think the four and from stealth is going to be more damage. Uh... Weak versus fire. Weak versus fire and blunt, actually. Weak versus fire, dark, normal resistance elsewhere. Weak versus fire and holy, so we're not going to have you go after him. So we'll just smack at the seahorse. Oh, look. He's going to die. Goodbye. Turn one, one hit deletion. And if that was the upgraded version, it would have actually been applying the sharp each time. So every hit would have actually have gotten even stronger. That's a lot of stacks being applied. <laughs> Apply nine stacks of burn to the highest HP monster. And get you up with thirty damage and a few, a little bit of bleed. Five. Let's do that. That. Apply more vulnerable, so we deal even more damage. Goodbye. Uh, 
smack. Smack the goat. See if we can't shoot for a little bit of healing before we end the fight here. Seven. Might have been nicer if you had ended up with some healing stuff. Use the sanctuary. It'll heal us up a little bit in the end. I actually prefer the other upgrade, uh, other upgrade to the battle plan, but it essentially is a gain of one energy. Holy storm, radiant assault. The Holy Nova. No Holy Ripple. So we will take a Holy Ripple. And we will not take any of that. Uh, yeah, let's take the battle plan. You arrive at an elven house that is completely frozen. Curiously, you have been able to open the door easily, and inside, although frozen, everything seems to be somewhat tidy. In the living room, you find a couple of frozen elves. No doubt someone has moved them and placed them together. They are dead, but at least the death was instantaneous. That comforts you a little. There is little else you can do here but try to look for something of value. Loot the dead. You don't find anything extraordinary that could be of use to you except for some gold. If there was anything, someone has hidden it well. So I'm guessing that there would be an item or something along those lines to... Um, no. That meteorite is... It, it hurts. A lot. Haha, -ha, another barrage. Again, wish it was the upgraded version. Uh, let's get the chant of accuracy. We'll mark you. Get into stealth and then boop you all to. Wow. You're half dead. More than half dead. Doop. 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 And doop. Good, at least he goes last. Stop shooting fireballs at the lava elemental. front monster I'd have to hope it hits him which it didn't Ah 
Can the piggy kill him? The answer to that is uh, assuredly no. Well, again, you're already shackled, so just get extra energy. Haha! -ha. Stab yourself to death. Uh, yep. Give us the Sanctify so that we can actually heal. I didn't even think about using it that way. Okay, so I can still get back into it. I can really get back into it. Ha! Uh, yes. Uh, most definitely. And no. Continue to the left wing and take the loot for Gustav. Yes! Thank you, Gustav. Ooh. Oh. Yeah, but anybody can take it. The Searing Blast, it's against all, but... Could go on her. Um, lose the Powerful for healing. And it unlocks it. And I don't necessarily think we need anything else here. Gustav unlocked! Yay! Uh, we want Command and Conquer. Uh, we want serrated weapons. Of which, uh, 10 times damage with hit applies 4 bleed and 1 sharp and gives all damage plus 3. The Command to Conquer, plus 4 defense charges, plus 1 powerful charges, and the next 4 skills. Uh, all heroes recover 6% HP and gain a powerful, which would actually be 2 because she's got the plus, uh, she'll get the plus one charges from it, of vitality and a mit damage mitigation. Uh, Cornelius. Do, 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 do. The next three fire spells gained four powerful and put th uh, an ember storm in my hand. 
or Phoenix. It would just, it, it's essentially just plus five damage at all times. And he'd resurrect if he dies. Phoenix. The next spell for every energy used, draw a card, deal 11 fire damage, apply four uh, burn and three sanctify to all monsters. Or the next defense, gain a shield and put a copy of it in your hand. Uh, solar flare. <laughs> uh, definitely solar flare. Uh, ooh. Now that, on the other hand. That's a lot of HP in addition. But there's no... It just essentially means the fight's going to go longer. That's all. As long as they don't one-shot anybody. Uh, going to be weak versus fire. I believe still weak versus fire. So let's take the explosive shot. Kind of weak versus fire for him as well. So yeah, it's right across the board. So good call. Takes three. And smack you with it. Yeah, that can't feel too good. I, I would not suggest attacking her. on my desk fall when I didn't even realize it. So I couldn't see the clock. Alright. Uh, smack you. Smack you some more. You hit the wrong dude. Stop it. Nobody told you to heal. And this is why I wanted the mask to spell. At least I did actually get an attack here. So we can play everything here. You may be immune to bleed, but you're not immune to slow. That's really stacking the stank Sanctify up because of that. Command and Conquer. A barricade. Uh, 
sure. Five stacks is not all that much. You... Do one extra, it should be lethal. Start applying stacks to you. And you still don't need to be healed after that. Mm. Stop it! Stop with the dispelling. just delete the ice dragon so we can stop dealing with that I, I would not recommend doing that essentially was also a heal because of the command and conquer yeah. all right um, I unfortunately cannot slow you down. Can I get lethal? Yes. Yes, I can. Uh, we'll take another adrenaline. I just got a corrupted one. Why would I want a normal one? I mean, yeah, it stays in the deck, but I just got a corrupted one. It would just bloat the deck. 50-50 shot. I don't think we need the healing. Alright. I cannot stack up thorns on her quite yet. Uh... think it's fire that he's weak against yes okay really no point using that so we're just getting the extra charges are sharp at the moment Not until you do your other thing. Yeesh, ouch. Stop with the thorns. No. That's a lot of damage and a lot of Sanctify. And you're not immune to Sanctify. Well, I don't think we're going to have a problem healing back up.
There was the steel tools right there. Okay. Uh, ignite yourself. And do that. There really is no point to that. Uh, you. All right. All right. Hang on a second, guys. We need to have a quick babby stream. Yeah, no, I see. Uh, no, 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 you can't have the cords. Stop. Stop with the cords. Stop with the cords. You can't have the cords. No, you cannot have the headphones. No headphones for baby. Stop it. Stop. You can't have the headphones. You can't have the headphones. No headphones for the baby. No. No headphones for the baby. Nope, you're not getting headphones. Uh -uh. Nope. You're too young to use the headphones. Too young for the headphones. Because all you'll do is sit there chewing on them. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. No. Where are you going? Where do you think you're going? Clop it down. Uh, uh, it, what are you doing? Like you keep on purposely sliding yourself off of the chair. No, you can't have the keyboard either. No, you can't have the keyboard either. We're, hey. We're live. Anybody in the world can see you. Stop trying to get at the computer. Oh, excuse you. Did you really have to do that live to the world? What are you doing? Baby smiles. What are you doing? You goofball. Oh, now you're trying to blow raspberries at the world? Hey, where are you going? By the way, that's all him. I'm not doing any of that. All I'm doing is making sure he doesn't fall off of me. Huh. Huh. Just making sure you don't fall off of me. Now you're watching your brother. You're not going in there to play 
Look at mommy. Look at mommy. Did you want more milk? Or more juice? Probably. Seems a little awkward. Oh, I know. You, you see mommy? Do you see mommy? Crawr! Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, no, I get you. Okay. Back to what we were doing. Killing this giant dragon. Uh, do to do. Yeah, I'm sorry. He stole some of your thorns. That first. It's alright. You're already beating him again in the thorn game anyway. Serrated weapons. Please. Flame. Why did he just lose all his fire charges? Oh, his burn charges. Oh, you... No, he doesn't have... The fire Ember doesn't do it. That shuffles into the deck. He's immune to ice. Why did he just lose all of his fire charges? That's a little confusing. Um... Hit the piggy first. Now you can cauterize. And he now has 85 charges on him. Uh, we can play everything that's left here. Yeah, it hurts, doesn't it? Hurts a lot, doesn't it? Well, it kind of sucks. I mean, not a bad setup turn, but didn't get to deal any damage to him. Hundred and two.
<laughs> and he dies to his own burn charges. Uh, yes, she will take a second wind, thank you. And a corrupted meditate, sure. Do you want an ambidextrous? Ranged melee, but you already have two of them. Ranged. You could get the rupture. Or the slices. Nah, not really. Uh, nothing corrupted. That's an ouch. Hmm. Do, do, do. If it was the other way around, it'd be okay for you, but it's not. So I don't think we want anything here. And moving on to Act 4, The Void. Although they had become... I've become accustomed to crossing the obelisks that time the sensation was somewhat different when they looked around they were astonished endless clouds and ancient ruins floating around them where were they certainly that place could not be reached on foot or in any normal way the group could feel how intense the magic was and without a doubt this had been lord hanshuk's goal with the obelisks on the horizon they saw a large staircase rising above the clouds that was where the group had to go to find out what Lord Hansick was up to. All right, and Forger Shop. Uh, let's check the shop first. You already have an amulet of thorns. You're already using that. Um, I think we flipped to that because of the... Well, do we want the Sanctify charges or do we want extra charges, essentially an extra charge being applied every turn to everybody? I think we go this way. Hmm. Well, that was a horrible reroll. One more. Oh, and on that run where I had that, that essentially like God tier um, weapon for the healer, I also had the golden bell on. So whenever I would heal anybody, it would also apply bless. I, it was. It just was ridic ridiculous. It just kept going. Nope. Uh, all right, into here. You have the second wind, which is extraordinarily expensive. The enrage. 
We have another camouflage here, which we want that one. Another adrenaline. Cornelius has a mana gem and the pyroblast. The mass dispel and the sanctuary. Well, I think first off, we want the sanctuary not going away. And I think we can actually get rid of some of these cards for Otis here. Uh, ditch that. Ditch the Infused Courage. Ditch the regular heal. And even the barrier heal. Uh, do I get rid of the Benediction? Hmm. Yeah, I still, even though it is blessed charges, I still think we get rid of the benediction here. Alright, that shit's in the deck quite a bit. As far as you go... Get rid of one of the Searing Touches. One of those gets rid of itself. A lot of these get rid of themselves, but... Definitely fewer attacks, but one of the uproots goes away. That goes away. That goes away. Both of those ones go away. The ammunition itself goes away, and we add one to our deck. That goes away. I never use this. It can just go away. Uh, it's better. Oh, you need to be changed to that one. Get rid of that. I mean, technically, that will be an attack that gives thorns in the end.
Well, let's do one. What do we get? A rend, a battle shout. Do you already have one of those? You do. It doesn't go away, but it dispels slow. Gives everybody more max HP and powerful. But it's expensive to try and add a second one in. Pulsing heal. That's technically another way into stealth. That would make itself go away. Uh, I'm going to say no to the battle shout. And I'm going to say no to that as well. Do I want the pulsing heal? I mean, it's a pretty big heal on one person. But pretty much because of him, all they need to do is attack. And now, just more shards. Uh, let's just uh, double check on stuff here. Uh, include the upgraded, thank you. Uh, I am going to spend on that. Do I want to spend on the spike ball too? We've already got to upgrade the enrage, so. She can't afford the demolishing blow. Do, do, do. We're already good there. Hmm. Disintegrate is extraordinarily expensive. Firestorm, which he does not have one. Which to me actually seems worse than two Ember Storms. Okay, no, it's worse than worse than three, which this would only be three energy versus four. It just means three cards in the deck outside of that. Uh, don't need another ignite.
And we really don't have any way of making those cheaper either. If we had a way of making them cheaper, I probably would grab a disintegrate, but... In which I'd grab this one, the blue. Could grab him a combustion. Hmm. Could grab him a holy fire. He's already got a holy storm. And he has a radiant assault. believe we can upgrade one of these yeah so there's the master spell which makes it not go away mana gem which again makes it not go away pyroblast getting even more expensive and making it go away the other adrenaline to make it not suffer and not go away, or to make it go away, but still not suffer the the fatigue. The enrage to also give powerful. Can't afford the second wind. Which I would go this way, giving the extra... The extra energize. It's draw, it's powerful. Hmm. Yeah, let's let's do up her in rage. I think we go shop. They're immune to bleed, which is not that big of a problem. They gain fury whenever they play an attack. So, spells do not count as attacks, which is definitely one thing to, like, to note. Um, it's only ranged attacks and melee attacks that count as attacks. So, small weapons, uh, all of the different element spells, songs, none of them count as attacks. Uh, they're immune to bleed. Let's grab the plague shot then. Smack them all. I mean, if I'm going to apply fury to everybody, might as well hit everybody.
Not worth. He's already going last in the turn order anyway. Of course you hit the wrong person. Can't use them both. Apply the charges. Definitely the serrated weapons. point in that. Hurts, don't it? Must really hurt. Bye bye to all your fury. Whew, she almost died. Oh, oh. that was lame. Get rid of most of those status effects. Okay, you're you're definitely dead. I am going to ignite you and then cauterize you. Yay, two damage. Into stealth and smack you good. Uh, not gonna matter. That's an unupgraded one. No thanks. Don't need any of that. And the only Tabula Rasa that I would want would be that one. I mean, you could get a 30% discount. Or I could grab... A 25% discount, but an extra 1,200 gold. Oh, yeah. oh. Yeah. All right, Cornelius. Merry Christmas.
Jeez, it's expensive. But I mean, it now goes to 20 versus 10 powerful, and every turn, he gains 6. Plus gains 2 when he plays a spell. Really wish I had seen a better weapon for Andrin. Well, don't really need that anymore. Because we just spent all our money. Adrenaline, serrated weapons. Uh, yes. Let's actually, oh, that's not the upgrade on all. Kind of hoping it was going to actually come back and hit him specifically again. Choop -a -doo. Mac. Bunch of sanctify out on them. Get the Phoenix out on you. Let's give him a whole bunch of energy. 38, 39, but that also hits the sides. 29 stacks, very nice. It really hurts, doesn't it? I mean, I, I really would not recommend attacking her. That is the all monsters one. Some extra sharp. And, you know, just like kind of delete people. Even hundred. Very nice. Yes, I will take a corrupt encyclopedia. Do I want a sacred ceremony? No, 
Uh, let's grab it. Because it's actually direct healing as well. How much is she applying worth of it? Two to all. One. Plus that on a turn. On a singular turn. It's not worth the Siege Breaker. The push forward, on the other hand, though. Hmm. I constantly fail with the Corrupt Bell, so let's not go for it. <gasps> oh, oh, yes. I will deal with it. Yes. Yes. Barricade up. Smack the elite a little bit. Thankfully, I have my headphones turned down a little bit more with that. Gotta love how much that hurts, don't you? Piggy boy, we're going to need some healing here. that first before we do that. Thank you. Uh, use the meditate. so much. Alright, it was on Cornelius. Beautiful. 
Nothing else really mattered at that point. It was a beautiful heal. The freezing the healer, though, kind of sucked. Like I said, I need, I need a couple of you guys to actually, like, kill yourselves here. Without Bree dying? I mean, I can get back in, but there's kind of no point. Apparently there was a point. Yeah, we need to... Get rid of the lightning stacks that keep coming here. Oh, that was... That was so painful. Evading. Oh, he's got one evade. And he's next. So let's just defend up here. That really, really no, no. Ah, oh. so close. If it wasn't an attack that actually hit everybody, we might have been okay. I can't believe I held on to that last fight as long as I did, actually. So still don't have the barrage on 